So I just thought I would end by sharing a couple things that I think could be really helpful for having a good attitude. And the first one is the most obvious one, is that you start your day off with a prayer, however you do that, or, or, or some affirmations, or something where you're setting yourself up with some life-affirming, positive self-talk, you know, like, okay, God, I can handle it. Whatever today's got in store for me, I'm one with you, God, and I know that we're going to do fine. You know, you've got to talk yourself up in the morning. I think it's important to surround yourself with reminders, and these would be keeping good company and having, uh, you know, if you saw my desk at home, it's just insane. I have affirmations of things all over the front of my desk, pictures of things, and then, and then my holy pictures, you know? So it's, it's, it's all um, stuff that I'm trying to impress upon my subconscious mind. Um, I think if you have a routine, it'll give you a little bit of a feeling of balance. And if we look at our interactions in this way, that we assume the best of people, not the worst. You know, that we try to spread a little bit of optimism and always try to build other people up. I think that's going to really support us in having a good attitude. I think if we speak in a life-affirming, positive language, that transforms our outlook. And, and I know this is a, a tough one, but you've got to avoid gossip. It's going to lead to higher stress for everybody. I think it's important to show other people appreciation, so we have to tell them. You know, hey, that was great. You did a good job here. Thank you for that. I think it's important to be kind to yourself, spiritually, mentally, emotionally, physically. And I think that every day, every day, and I know everybody's done this a million times, but you know, we're living in the world and our rough edges are bumping up against other people's rough edges. Every day, who do I need to forgive? Who do I need to forgive? Who do I need to forgive? And I think I'm a huge fan of doing gratitudes before you go to bed at night. You know, now, all of these things or any combination of whatever of those speak to you, if you would start to incorporate these, I think you would have and I would have a better attitude. And when you have a better attitude, better stuff happens in your life. That's just the way it is. Let's pray.